is Marquia McCarty, After Buzz TV, with Robin <laughs> from Justice League versus Teen Titans. Hey guys. How are you doing, Alan? What? How are you doing? Oh, I'm doing fantastic today. After all, we are at WonderCon, yeah. Yeah. Uh, is this your first WonderCon? Not. No, 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 no. Uh, my first one was actually uh, pretty hectic because um, beforehand I actually went to like uh, BotCon, you know, some of the smaller ones to kind of get warmed up for the big thing. Uh, and when I got here, I was like, oh, wow, this is like even bigger than I w uh, what I anticipated. And it was a little frightening at first, but it's great. It's great. Yeah. Wow. Fantastic. Well, you play Robin in Teen Titans, and uh, this is a very epic storyline, actually, Justice League versus Teen Titans, yeah, where you yeah. have to go up against your mentor, yeah. who's possessed by Trigun. Exactly. How did that feel for you? <laughs> that felt uh, a little bit weird. Well, I mean, I didn't exactly go up against my mentor specifically since um, he tried to uh, save himself, but I mean, it wasn't exactly so form because in Batman versus Robin, I did in a sense go up against him as well because of the rebellious teenager thing. But uh, yeah, this was definitely a new frontier, especially since Damien is now hanging out with kids his own age and learning what it's like to be a kid. Yeah, especially as you see at the carnival. Yeah. Oh, well, tell us more about that then. Well, uh, at the carnival, um, this whole real, uh, thing really is Damien learning to trust other people because in the first two movies, we see Damien is learning good morals, you know, justice, not vengeance. And then in the last two, he's learning more to, tr uh, to trust people and to take a leap of faith every once in a while. And uh, he actually gets a chance to be a normal kid uh, once he joins the Teen Titans, which uh, really helps out uh, with making him learn to trust other people more and take some of the weight off his shoulders. Oh, it kind of sounds like maybe you've learned a lesson, too, along with your journey with being Robin. Yes, I have. Yeah, uh, absolutely. You know, uh, teamwork is very essential. In fact, I kind of like to classify this Teen Titans film with the three T's. Teens, Titans, teamwork. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. What a great lesson. Yeah, thank you. I actually just posted it on Twitter. Yeah. yeah. Hey, you've got to check out that Twitter right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, give them your Twitter handle just in case they don't know. Oh, sure, yeah. My Twitter handle is at Stuart Allen. That's Stuart as in Stuart Little, A-L-L-A-N, 42. Fantastic. Okay, so I know with the other Teen Titans, it's one of the things that they don't really have secret identities. It's more like they are their own superhero, like that's what they grab onto. While with Robin, that's slightly different because he does have Damien and he's also Robin at the same time. So my question is, what's your superhero ability? My superhero ability? Yeah. Hmm. That's kind of tough. There's so many great super abilities out there. Uh, I'd actually like the uh, the chance to um, teleport. Yeah, I, I love tele uh, I love teleportation. I'm really much into like the sci-fi stuff, especially with um, you know it's just. I like the ability to just kind of just go from place to place instantly. And plus, you can get around that LA traffic. You know, you can never beat that. <laughs> oh, no. That's that's horrific, and there's yes, nothing absolutely. to be done. Well, actually, if you think that's bad, go to Lowell, Massachusetts. I know from firsthand. I was stuck on a bridge for three hours. Oh, no. <laughs> yes, exactly, yeah. <laughs> only if you could have had the Teen Titans then. Yeah, yeah, if only I could have those teleportation powers. <laughs> Uh, well, this has been amazing speaking with Stuart Allen here at WonderCon 2016. Is there anything else that you would like to tell our young and uh, mature viewers? Yeah. Uh, young and mature viewers, I guess uh, if you're trying to get into voiceover acting and just really acting in general, just you got to love doing it and you got to be patient because it's going to take a while to, uh, to get your foot in the door. But once you do, it's a lot easier. Yeah. Heard it first from Robin, Damien, Stuart. 